Hello, this is Justin from Effortless Booking at EffortlessBooking.com, the best place to find the cheapest and most affordable flight tickets and hotels all around the world. Welcome to today's video. In this video, we will be looking at the top 10 best places to visit in Panama. But before we dive into this, please make sure that you click the subscribe button on YouTube and turn on the notification bell so that you'll not miss any of our daily videos. We are also available on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter and Pinterest at Effortless Booking. That being said, let's dive in. Top 10 Best Places to Visit in Panama Discover Panama, the undiscovered paradise known as the Bridge of the Americas, where history, culture, nature, and adventure await you in the cosmopolitan city of Panama City. Exotic beaches, private islands, national parks, 25% of the country is national parks, accessible rainforests, mountain retreats, and more are the top attractions. Here are the best places to visit in Panama. Number 10. Los Cangelones. If you're looking for village shopping and canyon views while jumping in the nearby waters, Los Cangelones is your go-to destination. There is a bus that costs only $1.50 per ride to get there. If you need snacks for beach supplies, a mini supermarket awaits you when the bus drops you off. In the canyons and waters, you can sunbathe, swim, and sightsee privately, depending on the number of people near you. After swimming in the water, pack a big picnic to enjoy the amazing views. Number 9. Highlands of Boquit. The Chiriqui Highlands region of Costa Rica includes Boquit, a small town. In addition to the nearby Baru volcano, the town is also known for its hot springs and coffee plantations. The cool cloud forest climate also attracts the rare Quetzal bird. As you pass through Baru Volcano National Park on the way to Cerro Punta, walk along the Los Quetzales trails to search for Quetzals and other exotic clouds forest birds. Number 8. Azuero Peninsula. Traditional crafts, handicrafts, and ceramics have been made on the Azuero Peninsula since pre-Columbian times. A typical Panamanian dress for women, colorful masks, and the handcrafting of the Polera costume will be on display to visitors. Tourists have also been flocking to Chibra, Las Tablas, and Petasi in recent years. Iguana Island is a popular warm water snorkeling spot with schools of colorful fish, turtles, rays and moray eels nearby the Azuero Peninsula. In addition to crabs, iguanas, bird nesting sites, and little coves, the island has many natural wonders. Number 7. Santa Catalina. A quiet fishing village off Panama's Pacific coast, Santa Catalina is a popular tourist destination. Travelers are attracted to the village because of its remoteness and unspoiled authenticity. As an added bonus, Santa Catalina is a popular surfing and diving spot with fantastic beaches and a frequent gateway to Coiba National Marine Park. Santa Catalina is small enough to be explored entirely on foot. There are no major landmarks, man-made attractions, or shopping malls in this quaint village, but there are friendly people, a laid-back atmosphere, and sandy beaches where tourists can swim, snorkel, dive, and sport fish. It is also a surfer's dream with some of the best and most regular surf breaks in all of Central America. Number 6. Panama City. The capital and largest city of Panama, Panama City, is full of things to shout about. In addition to being the capital of the nation and of the province, it is also one of the most modern cities in Central America. This modern city has been dubbed the Dubai of Latin America. You can find high-end resorts, shopping malls, and glitzy skyscrapers lining every street. The average city dweller won't walk more than half a mile on foot. Panama City is known for its splendid views surrounded by the Panamanian rainforest. Experience the Panama Canals might with a skydive, climb up the Bridge of the Americas for a stunning view of the cityscape, or cycle the Amador Causeway to the Four Islands. Number 5. The Pearl Islands. The Pearl Islands are located in the Gulf of Panama, 40 miles southeast of Panama City. In 1513, a mysterious archipelago of 97 pearl-encrusted islands was revealed to Europeans by an Indian chief. In the years since then, pearl mining has become the main business on the islands, where the famous 31-carat peregrine pearl was discovered. One of the most attractive snorkeling spots is found on the Pearl Islands, which feature 83 excellent beaches, a variety of hotels, and guest houses. 
Number 4. Casco Viejo. The attractive area of Casco Viejo sits to the east of the country's capital Panama City. This is the very first settlement built by Europeans on the Pacific coast. It was founded in 1519 and soon it became one of the most important trading centers on the continent. Some of the buildings, however, remain to this day, such as the Cathedral of Panama Viejo, the Santo Domingo and San Francisco Convent Ruins, La Merced Church, San Jose Temple, and King's Bridge. The old quarters of Panama Viejo were recognized as a World Heritage Site by UNESCO in the late 20th century. Number 3. Bocas del Toro Islands. Visit the Bocas del Toro Islands, a lush, lush Caribbean archipelago surrounded by white sand and filled with around 300 small islets you can explore by kayak during the day. In this raw paradise, there are many sustainable lodges to choose from. There is a slow pace of life on the islands. There is a rich history of exploration, conquest, and bananas in Bocas del Toro. Bocas del Toro was discovered by Christopher Columbus in 1502. Spanish rule over Panama lasted until 1903. Afterwards, bananas boomed as Chiquita banana plantations took flight in the Caribbean, attracting workers from everywhere. Number 2. Panama Canal. Panama Canal is one of the most popular attractions in the country. It was this 48-mile waterway that connected the Atlantic Ocean to the Pacific Ocean in 1914. The Panama Canal was one of the most difficult engineering projects in history, allowing ships to avoid the dangerous Cape Horn route. It takes between six and eight hours for ships to pass through the canal today. Panama Canal Day Tours are available. There are a lot of jungles and waterways along the Panama Canal. A popular tourist attraction along the Panama Canal is Gatun Lake, one of the world's largest artificial lakes. There are boat tours, kayaking, fishing, hiking, and ziplining available on Gatun Lake. Number 1. San Blas Islands. San Blas Bay stretches to the Colombian border along the Caribbean coast of Panama along the San Blas Archipelago. Cuna Indians have inhabited the islands since ancient times. There are 378 San Blas Islands in the autonomous region, of which only 49 are inhabited. Indian economics, language, and customs are supported by the Indians. During your visit to the San Blas Islands, you will experience traditional Indian crafts, learn captivating legends, and listen to Indian music and dance. Tourism and coconut cultivation drive the island's economy. That's where we'll call it wrap for today's video on top 10 best places to visit in Panama. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and if you do, please leave a comment in the comments section and we'll make sure we respond to all your comments, and don't forget to share this video. Even if you did not enjoy it, well, still let us know in the comments section. Finally, don't forget to book your next flight on EffortlessBooking.com, it is the best place to find the cheapest and most affordable flight tickets and hotels to anywhere around the world. Don't believe me? A trial will convince you. Until then, watch out for our next video, subscribe and share. Have a nice day.